Hello everyone and welcome to a first impression video that I'm going to do for you. I guess I'm going to be playing this game Track Racing Online. And I was uh, asked to review this game by a person named Solkey who contacted me and said he wanted me to review his freeware game that I think is available on iOS and maybe Android and for PC download. Anyway, it looks a lot like Trackmania, the real game, so I figured why not give it a try and we'll see how it is. Ooh, that is loud. Let me look. Okay, so we start off a little bit slow, and uh, okay, so keyboard and mouse seem to actually be rather responsive, which is nice. I, um, I can't say I'm very good at this, by the way, but let's just see if I can get through the first level, and I'm playing on them very easy. Alright, so that was, uh, pretty simple go on easy again, zero opponents, and I don't want to play online. I think it just automatically jumps you into a game if you let that go. But, uh, I tried that before I recorded the video, and unfortunately, it kind of crashed the game. So I think that might be something to do with me, though, because I didn't extract all the files. I didn't really trust this download, but it seems to have not screwed up anything on my computer. So, I can give it a, a pass right now. Now that second track looked kind of cool. I was hoping for a loop, but we didn't get it. This it kind of reminds me of that old, uh, that old uh, game in the arcades that you used to uh, sit in the, you know, sit in the fake car and had really slow frame rate and it was like rendered on what looked like a Sega Genesis with the loops. But let me get my mouse out of the way here. I'm, I'm though they seem very responsive at least in the easiest difficulties and uh, other than obviously low texture I mean it's an indie game obviously other than the low textures and the no music in the background and the one sound for the engine it seems to be fairly well developed and like an easy version of Trackmania the uh, non-freeware version. But right now I haven't had to move. Okay, there we go. And I could see this being a quick little diversion on the PC for no more than you know a couple minutes at the time. Who knows, maybe, maybe you're drunk or something and you just want to screw around on a game and get high scores. But if, let's, let's just see if the Let's see if we go up a difficulty. Oh, these are locked. I guess you have to start on on easy. Maybe he hasn't put all the games in uh, or all the maps in yet. But let's. Oh, look, they've got. Oh, they've got a comment system on the side here. This looks like it's player-generated comments. That's pretty cool. Uh, should we try the beta? Well, let's look at the option menu. Oh, we could option to show our ghost, that's kind of cool. Advanced settings, okay. Full screen, keyboard is not rebindable, but looks like you could put a joystick in here, that's not bad. Uh, let's see what languages they have. Oh, okay, so if you don't speak English, sorry that you're watching my video, but that seems to work. Let's see, can we select a car? These are all locked. Oh, and it seems like they are in the game. You just need medals. So let's try and get ourselves some more medals here. Okay, so I let that one go through without saying play alone. And maybe this just shows the ghosts of other players. No, that doesn't seem like it's it. But here's a variety. You know, map variety. This is at night. Kind of got that, um... F-Zero style to it. Oop, that wasn't very uh, good, but then again, I didn't claim to be good at these Twitch racing games. I have to break there. You're probably not supposed to break either. A lot of, I know track media, most of it can be beaten by just barely manipulating the uh, control surface. But, you know what? This isn't a terrible uh, indie game. I mean, it steals a lot from obviously much more successful games but I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna be instituting a patent infringement or anything of that sort so 
so they don't have to worry about me. I gotta say, I gotta thank Solkey for reaching out. I'm sure he just gives this to a lot of small YouTubers. But this, is, this truly isn't that bad. And if this is out on iOS and Android, maybe with, uh, oh god help it, movement motion controls, I could see it being a little fun. And then for a free game, I'm enjoying my time. A little disoriented by those arrow signs, but what are you going to do? There's slight particle effects on hitting things, which is kind of cool. You can see our speed on the bottom right. Apparently there are two laps into this one. I think we're... Oh, now we're on our second lap. Okay. Maybe I'll do one more race after this, uh, after this, after this one. And we'll wrap it up because I think I've pretty much gotten everything out of it. I'm going to try that multiplayer beta for you guys. Hopefully it won't crash. I don't see many bugs right now except for that one thing that happened at the very beginning. But like I said, that's probably more my fault. On our final lap, one more turn to this disorienting arrow minefield. Alright, and... Okay, let's just go back. Let's try this multiplayer beta. Alright, 7 out of 12 people. Let's see if we can get in. Oh my... God, what is... Now this is what I'm talking about. How did I not... How did I not just jump into this all right away? This is, uh, looks like some kart racing. With some shooting. Got, uh, some sort of... Machine gun on the... Oh. Let's see. Oh, I don't want to pass him. I kind of want to shoot him. He just raced past me. Oh, man, I definitely like this. I've got the flag, and I, I was killed. Okay. This is definitely something that I can see myself playing more than once. Now that I, I see how this works. So I am going to give this one a thumbs up to check out. I'll put a link in, my, in the description. But if this gets any sort of player base where there's, you know, five, six people playing online on the server, this could be just a free, uh cart racing slash uh, demolition derby. Let's try to pick up good stuff. Let's see if I can't kill him. Oh, yep, taking off. Yep, I killed him 10 points. So hitbox don't seem to be perfect, but everyone's using the USA car. Alright, one one more life and then I'll exit out of this. I wonder if there are different maps too. This seems to be uh, just one long track that doesn't have any objective other than capturing the flag, which seems like they have our blue flag right now. Frame rate steady at 120, which is nice, even though I'm at 60 hertz monitor. Oh, it's off the map, let's see what happens. Okay. Crabler90 killed myself, I guess. Alright, let's let's quit. And uh let's just check out the level later and that'll be it. Check out video tutorials on YouTube, okay. Oh wow. Yeah, this is cool. Yes, I'm I'm a big fan. I'm gonna give this one a definite thumbs up, guys. So just so you know, this is uh let's let's just get back here. This is track racing online and let's check it out together. Uh comment, let me know what you thought of the video and let me know what you think of track racing online. Thank you again. This was Cradler90 with the first impression slash review.